The manufacturers in Industrial Park are equipped with WME system. The RFID-enabled inventory control point in the system can automatically monitor the material inventory and generate material requests once the stock is lower than the safe inventory level. First of all, let's see the cross-stocking procedure. When the material distribution requests are sent to the request pool in ship, the order manager can use the decision support module to make the order picking or cross-stocking plan. In the order picking plan, materials are get from storage area to shipping dock. In a cross-stocking plan, materials are directly moved from receiving dock to shipping dock. Then forklift dispatcher will assign these plans to forklifts and operators. The forklift driver uses RFID handheld terminal to download the task. The handheld device would guide the driver go to the right location, get the right pallet, and move to the right shipping dock. The whole process will be monitored and controlled by the warehouse management system. In a milk run material transportation procedure, at the beginning, the transportation planner downloads materials collection or distribution requests. The planning system will make the plan to determine what material requests should be combined into one milk run. The material quantity, size, delivery route, and delivery time window should be considered in this plan. Then, the fleet dispatcher will use a fleet scheduling system to assign material collection and distribution plans to truck drivers. When the truck driver receives the milk run material transportation plan, he can check the detailed information and follow the route to different customers one by one. When the driver gets a location, the customer will receive a notification of truck arrival. The RFID handheld terminal will help the driver to confirm the customer's identification. Then, the required materials list for loading or unloading will be displayed on his handheld device. Every loading and unloading operation will be checked and confirmed with the handheld device. Once the loading or unloading process is done, the truck driver will move to the next destination following the list on his handheld device.